Inside the Huddle, presented by Sports Media Incorporated. Inside the Huddle is filmed live on location at the House of Blues Sunday nights in downtown Dallas. Let's go, 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 go. Inside the Huddle, Inside the Huddle, presented by Sports Media Incorporated. The marketing pros. And welcome back to the 24th season of Inside the Huddle at the House of Blues. I'm Mark Elfenbein, and again, welcome to our title sponsor, the Health Bite Center. I'm here as your host, and of course, with my co-host this week, the one only Tyler Klutz is in the house again. And he has brought with him his special guest, running back Robert Turbin, ladies and gentlemen. All right, fellas, let's learn a little bit about Robert Turbin. Mm. Let's do that. Oakland, California, born and raised. All right. Fremont, California, Irvington High School. Yes. In Irvington High School, he was a first-team all-league running back. And you're going to love this, Tyler. Home of the Irvtown Hit Squad. The oh. Hit Squad. You know what I'm saying? So, hey. They didn't mess around. Didn't mess around at like all. It. But see, here's where Klutz can r- r- relate to you. He was first all-league running back and an all-league defensive back as a senior. Oh, man. Two-way? Yes. There you go. And Free safety. check this out. These are some crazy numbers Free in high safety. school. He earned Defensive Player of the Year award. He had 143 carries for 1,232 yards, scored 14 touchdowns, and had six interceptions. Six. Tell you what, a couple of them I took to the house, Klutzy. I believe that. You got the speed? Did you have the speed back in the day? And I see those biceps coming at me. (laughs) There's no way I'm trying to catch a ball. That's for sure. You're right. (laughs) You're right. You're right. But I was more. I was always trying to get interceptions, though. I mean, unless I was, you know, like upset about something. See, he was the sack. Then I was trying to take you out. He was the defensive end. He was the sack. You're a defensive end. That was a D end. Yeah, through college. Through college. Yeah, see, we're, see, we're bonding on, I know. on live I, TV right here. That's I, I, what, what I'm talking once, about. Yeah, once I found out that he was defense as well, I thought, this is perfect, yep. you guys. Whack Offensive Player of the Year. You go to Utah State. Yes. Tell me how that came about. Recruiting, and why did you choose Utah State? Um, I was getting recruited by, you know, some Pac-10, Pac-10 at the time. Okay. Schools, Oregon, Washington. Boise State was another school interested in me. San Jose State was a hometown school that was interested in me. Most of them wanted me to play defense. You know, University of Washington was kind of, uh, we don't know yet. Free safety, corner, running back, we kind of want to try you everywhere. And so, uh, you know, when I first went to Irvington High School, Irvington was, was, in, was in high school that hadn't had very much success since it, you know, first started. Okay. And so, when my class came in, when we were freshmen, we always kind of had this goal like, hey, you know, when we're seniors, when we're juniors, and we go to varsity, we're gonna change this thing around. We're gonna, you know, try to win a championship for our school and do some things that had never been done here before. And so, and we did. We were able to have that success. And so, when Utah State came about, Utah State was a school that hadn't had much success in years. It had been successful before, but it had been a long time. 20 plus. Yeah, Utah got most of the play. You know what I mean? Right. BYU as well. Of course. And, and so it intrigued me because, I, you know, I, I like being the underdog. I said, you know what? Uh, maybe if I go to Utah State, bring a winning mindset, coming from a winning high school, maybe we can change some things around. I didn't want to go to Oregon. They were already good. They were always going to be good. University of Washington, I felt the same way. You're already good. You're always going to be good. Utah State... It's like, I feel like they needed somebody good, you know? And that's why I wanted to go there. I wanted to go there and change the program around. I just got to take my hat off to this guy because uh, you talked about assimilating into a locker room. uh, And this guy assimilated to our locker room so well and so fast. He's a guy that's uh, that's there till 6.30, 7 o'clock every night. Last guy to leave the building. Puts in the work. He picked up our playbook faster than anybody that I've ever seen. We have, we'd had guys on our, on our team uh, for six, eight, ten weeks. And he knew more than these guys in an hour and a half. And uh, it's a credit to him caring about his job, caring about what he does, and loving the game. And, and he's done an unbelievable job coming in. And um, I'm glad that, that he got to uh, uh, see the benefit of that on the field uh, on Sunday against Green Bay. And I mean, he ran his tail off. Tyler Klutz, yeah. Robert Turbin. All right, coming up next, we're going to find out a little bit more about Robert Turbin. And can anybody outrun Lael Collins? And we'll talk about that next on Inside the Huddle. I wish I'd done it sooner. Way sooner. 
With dentures, I couldn't eat corn on the cob. With missing teeth, I couldn't smile for family portraits. Apples, steak. Now I smile all the time. All it took was one special place. Now it's my time. My time to laugh. To live. It's my time to be me again. Experience excellence. Dr. Ramsey Fanous, our board certified specialist, has affordable solutions to saving faces and changing lives throughout North and West Texas. Home Loans Made Simple is our focus. With 15 years of DFW mortgage experience, the Will Austin Home Loan Team will provide service beyond expectations for you and your family. Choosing the right lender is crucial to your success as a home buyer, and we want to ensure you are meeting your financial goals. Let us help you get there. We are family, not numbers. Please visit willaustinhomeloans.com or call 972-951-9794 to discuss options that best fit your needs. Rooting for your favorite team. Enjoying your tailgate party. Perhaps just meeting new people. Having fun. Even enjoying a dance or two before the game. Now these ladies are having a diva moment. Brought to you by Diva Tequila. A Dale Bravo Company. America's favorite vacation company is flying nonstop from Dallas, Fort Worth. Save hundreds with Apple Vacations to Mexico and the Caribbean. Secrets Resorts and Spas offer unlimited luxury for adults only escapes. Airfare, hotel, premium brand drinks, gourmet meals, all tips, and more. Call your travel agent or visit us online today. Apple Vacations, America's favorite vacation company. Do you have old collections appearing as new collections on your credit report? This is a common tactic used by creditors and junk debt buyers. Did you know when they changed the date making that collection account look new, that tactic is illegal and they broke the law? Our computer system has been holding creditors accountable to the law for over a decade. If this is happening to you or someone you know, or you'd just like to have a consultation to find out what you can do to improve your score, call DNG Credit LLC, the Credit Cops, here to protect and serve your credit score. Welcome back to Inside the Huddle at the House of Blues, presented by our Health Bite Center, the greatness of Health Bite Center. We'd like to welcome all our viewers from Lubbock, oh Texas, on KMYL in Lubbock, Texas. Guns up, Lubbock, Texas. And all our DFW Metroplex viewers on TXA21. Thanks for joining us. Again, Robert Turbin, Tyler Klutz, What's House that? of Blues. Down yeah. in this part of the world, when they think 12th man, they think A&M. But in Seattle, obviously, there was 12th man as well. Can you mm -hmm. share the story with us about your special relationship with the 12th man and the story about Alex Hughes? Yeah, so Alex, Alex met a friend of mine. He was at a game. He met a friend of mine. Uh, and, uh, you know, he, you know, felt like, you know, he wanted to get an autograph. And, you know, he missed the opportunity. The team, you know, we were already kind of done with our festivities and, you know, kind of getting ready to go to the game. We had curfew and everything that night. And the next day after the game, he couldn't get an autograph. And, and so, uh, so my friend, you know, she came up to me and said, hey, you know, this guy uh, I met, you know, at the, at the hotel, was really bummed about not getting an autograph. And, uh, you know, wanted to know if he could sign it. And I said, yeah, you know, send this helmet to me. Get the whole team to sign it. You know, I won't, you know I'll, get the, I'll get everybody to sign it. And that's what I did. Got the whole team to sign it. I sent it to him. I didn't, exp I didn't know he was going to be, you know, that emotional about it. I didn't know it meant that much to him, you know, but, uh, but uh, it did. And anything, anytime you can do, you know, something special for a fan, you want to take that opportunity. I want to ask you both this. Mm -hmm. Do you remember a time when you got an autograph of an athlete that you just were, oh my gosh, I just got so-and-so's autograph? Yeah, uh, so I grew up in California, uh, right. about an hour outside of Rockland, California. And that's where the San Francisco 49ers used to have training camp. And uh, 
I used to go up and we'd go probably every once a week or so my dad would take us up and we'd watch practice and see Jerry Rice, Steve Young, Ricky Waters, Brent Jones, uh, all those guys. And, and I remember I had this 49ers pennant and I had Jerry Rice, Brent Jones, Steve Young all signed on it. And that was, I mean, I, there was nothing cooler to me than, than those guys to even just take the time and uh, you know, come up to the fence and sign autographs for kids. And, and that's why our training camp uh, really make an effort every day to go over and sign stuff for kids. Because, I mean, really, for me, it, it made my, my day, my year. And that may have been the spark that, that started my love for the game because, uh, you know, the guys I saw on TV were so gracious to, to stop and sign an autograph for us um, after, you know, a practice in 105 degree weather. Robert, yourself? You know, I never really had that opportunity. I was, I was able to meet some guys. I met Jerry Rice at the Nike Combine or the Nike Camp down in Stanford that they used to do every year. And, uh, you know, met a couple of the Raiders and stuff like that after games. Uh, never got autographs. I never had, like, anything with me. I always came unprepared for whatever <laughs> reason. <laughs> but, uh, but just to meet them um, was, was enough for me, especially since it was my goal to be where they were you know, at, at that age, so. Lastly, in yesterday's game, I think the last time Cowboy fans saw an offensive lineman do this was Larry Allen several years uh, ago, literally chasing a guy 50 yards down from behind. Can you talk about Lael Collins running 45 yards down the field, leading the way after already making a block? Yeah. Yeah, I think Darren needs to work on his 40 time. Yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna, <laughs> trust me, when we get in meetings tomorrow, we're going to bring that up. That's going to be a fine oh, for yeah, sure. Definitely That's going to be a fine for sure. But, yeah, you, gotta, you love the effort. You love the passion. Um, you know, knocking down the ha-ha Clinton Dix and, and then continuing on. That's really his name. I heard a couple chuckles. Um, he really but, is. <laughs> uh, you know, and, and running down the field. And, um, you know, you love that. And that's, that's the attitude that I think that he's uh, – he, he's – stolen and learned from the rest of the guys because those guys play their tails off every day and uh, you know it's contagious and um, you know he's just a rookie and, and um, I mean the ceiling for him is really high and uh, it'll be exciting to see what he can do with it. Man can boogie and he's a big boy. Yeah. All right, it's Tyler Kletz, it's Robert Turbin, this is Inside the Huddle. All right coming up next Christmas is around the corner we found out what these two cats are gonna do all coming up next on Inside the Huddle. I wish I'd done it sooner. Way sooner. With dentures, I couldn't eat corn on the cob. With missing teeth, I couldn't smile for family portraits. Apples, steak. Now I smile all the time. All it took was one special place. Now it's my time. My time to laugh. To live. It's my time to be me again. Experience excellence. Dr. Ramsey Fanous, our board-certified specialist, has affordable solutions to saving faces and changing lives throughout North and West Texas. Buying your new home should be a joyous experience. The Lisa Birdsong Group with Ebby Halliday Realtors takes care of the details so you can focus on what matters most. Lisa Birdsong's team of seasoned professionals will guide you with expertise and integrity throughout the buying and selling process. Meet the Lisa Birdsong Group and experience their award-winning services today. Call 214-394-3314 or visit us at birdsongrealty.com. Uh, whenever I got to my biggest point, uh, I was 293. Uh, I was on two cholesterol medications and also on a blood pressure medicine. Life after my procedure is great with my kids. Uh, I can participate in more sports with them. My name is Heath Prophet, and to this date, I've lost 93 pounds. People assume quality car insurance has to cost more. People assume too much. The truth is, drivers who switched to Allstate last year saved money and got better protection. So get the facts because you know what they say about people who assume they pay more for car insurance than you and me. Pay less. Get more with Allstate in DeSoto. Allstate agent Burt Maxwell. Call for a quote today at 972-224-9181. America's favorite vacation company is flying nonstop from Dallas-Fort Worth. Save hundreds with Apple Vacations to Mexico and the Caribbean. Secrets Resorts and Spas offer unlimited luxury for adults-only escapes. Airfare, hotel, premium brand drinks, gourmet meals, all tips, and more. Call your travel agent or visit us online today. Apple Vacations, America's favorite vacation company. 
Over two years, I've lost a total of 185 pounds. My self-confidence has totally changed. I mean, I get to do things that I never got to do before. Dr. J and Dallas Bariatric Center helped me find the real me and gave me my life back. And welcome back to Inside the Huddle, presented by the Health Fight Center. I'm Mark Elfemine, along with Cowboy running backs, Tyler Klutz, Robert Turbin. Glad to have them in the house. Holidays are here. Christmas is around the corner. So I'm curious, Christmas parties scheduled, family, have, have they started? Are players having little parties? Do you, do you not have them yet? Is the season, nah, no parties? The Joneses do a great job here. Do they and, do a Christmas party every yeah, year? Yeah, we got one... Uh, you're not on the email list, man? Bro. <laughs> I just got here. I'll forward you the email. <laughs> I'll, I'll, get it, I'll get it to you. But we have one. Uh, so we play Saturday Poor night. Robert Turbin. I know, man. You play supposed to, he got his jersey no, retired. Man. He can't get a dang invitation. Hey. You're supposed to have my back throughout this whole thing, dog. <laughs> I'm trying to add in the distractions right. to your game. You I focus hear you. On it. But, uh, yeah, we have one next Sunday. So, actually, uh, Saturday's the game. Yeah, Saturday's the game, and we have it Sunday. So uh, they do a great job. It's, uh, it's really nice. Uh, kick back the, the entire organization with you know coaches front office staff support staff marketing department merchandise uh, everybody across the board we we go to the stadium they have live music and it's just a really nice night to just you know really just relax and and, and enjoy the season and in, enjoy being around each other and uh, I actually just came from the Joneses also do one for the kids um, down in the stadium on the field they do uh, like a big train around the outside of the field and oh, wow. bounce houses and slides and they have a Christmas uh, or gingerbread uh, station where they can make gingerbread uh, houses and uh, pictures with Santa and food and all kinds of stuff and so the kids enjoy it I, my wife I think likes it more than my two kids do but now, uh, one of the things that happens at this time of the year and it's either a wonderful occasion or it's a beating. Mm -hmm. The infamous holiday cards. Beating. You know, like, okay, we're all getting together and we're wearing the same color shirt with jeans. And do you both have to get into that? Is that set up for you or do you set it up yourself or you don't mess with it? Uh, you know, was in college for five years, so nope. <laughs> we're always playing a game. You know, I yeah. feel like we're always preparing for a game since I've been a pro, so. I've been able to dodge those things. Yeah, Nicely not, done. Not yeah. Not me. Mr. Yeah. Mr. Klutz, not yeah, no dodging. You know, uh, my, my wife's good that she takes the responsibility, uh, but uh, you know, it's still, <laughs> our pictures took two, two separate uh, photo sessions. So oh. uh, that was, it was fun. <laughs> you see, and see, here's the thing. You don't get to approve it. No, no, no. See, I don't even, you might no. think it looks good. And go, no, no, she, no. Yeah, you picked, that she one. picked like 75 of the pictures. I didn't look at a single one. She made all the calls yeah. and Christmas cards she picked out, you know, and then when she needs addresses from, from uh, coaches and players, that's when I got to actually go talk to guys and, hey, need your address. <laughs> I well, remember four. doing it one year, bro. You, get, you have to go in these awkward yeah. poses oh, and yeah. all that kind of stuff, and oh, I'm just yeah. like, I got to do what? All right. Answer this question. Gift cards are better to give or receive? Receive. 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 receive for you sure. actually like them? Uh, you know, I mean, does it make it easier for you? It makes it easier. It's just like we talked about earlier, like how you may forget, hey, I saw your, uh, yeah. your gift card or your, your picture on somebody's refrigerator. Where's mine at? It's like, look, I don't even want to deal with that, OK? That's why I don't do the photos. Yeah. Just send me some. <laughs> you know, I put them in my office, and thank you. Merry yeah. Christmas. We, it, the, the gift card thing is, is, is funny because you feel guilty giving it. Yeah, because it, 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 it's, it, it's like They're you didn't awesome put to much. Get, which is funny because you forget, like, oh, my gosh, it's so so bad that I didn't have time to get you a gift, so I just got you a $50 Home Depot gift Well, because card. It's, it's, it's like it's, well, you're, you're, in, the, that, though. you're yeah, in the see, checkout line, and it's an impulse buy. Oh, yeah. you know what? I forgot their gift bank. Yeah. You know, because you didn't put much thought into it. Yeah. But you don't have to put a lot of thought into it when you want to go spend it. It's, I think those are harder to give than they are to get because I enjoy them. I, I love giving them. I don't them. get offended at it, all. No, but it works. As a giver, you're like, I, I'm sure they're thinking that I forgot their gift for sure. And this is last minute. Guy and the funny thing store. is, is you try to dress up the gift card in an envelope, you know? <laughs> you, you ever try just to wrap it? And <laughs> yeah, wrap you try to make it a nice big envelope. <laughs> Isn't it almost better 
You know, that way it's like, look, you know you have a friend. You know that friend likes to shop at Nordstrom. Yeah. Right. So just give them a gift card. Right. Yeah. You know? So they don't have I to don't know what you want of. from there, but I know you like to shop there, so here you go. Ladies and gentlemen, Tyler Kletz, Robert Turbin of the Dallas Cowboys. We'll be back with more of Inside the Huddle coming up next. I wish I'd done it sooner. Way sooner. With dentures, I couldn't eat corn on the cob. With missing teeth, I couldn't smile for family portraits. Apples, steak. Now I smile all the time. All it took was one special place. Now it's my time. My time to laugh. To live. It's my time to be me again. Experience excellence. Dr. Ramsey Fanous, our board certified specialist, has affordable solutions to saving faces and changing lives throughout North and West Texas. Buying your new home should be a joyous experience. The Lisa Birdsong Group with Ebby Halliday Realtors takes care of the details so you can focus on what matters most. Lisa Birdsong's team of seasoned professionals will guide you with expertise and integrity throughout the buying and selling process. Meet the Lisa Birdsong Group and experience their award-winning services today. Call 214-394-3314 or visit us at birdsongrealty.com. What if you could fly without a plane? What if you could fly without wings? What if you could fly without a parachute? Without strings attached? Or even a cape? What if is here? Every age, every ability. I fly indoor skydiving, fun every time. Over 30 years of experiences in this company on fixing and repairing garage doors and garage door openers. Garage doors never break Monday through Friday 8 to 5. It's normally like 4 o'clock in the afternoon or 6 o'clock at night. Really what I feel is we are a customer service company. We want the customer's experience or the homeowner's experience to far exceed anything that they've ever experienced before. Home Loans Made Simple is our focus. With 15 years of DFW mortgage experience, the Will Austin Home Loan Team will provide service beyond expectations for you and your family. Choosing the right lender is crucial to your success as a home buyer, and we want to ensure you are meeting your financial goals. Let us help you get there. We are family, not numbers. Please visit willaustinhomeloans.com or call 972-951-9794 to discuss options that best fit your needs Welcome back to Inside the Huddle, presented by the Health Bite Center. This week's title sponsor is Eddie Mendoza with MM Auto Repair. Thanks for joining us tonight. One of the things that's special about MM is your warranty procedure, which is amazing. Explain how that works. You know, we create a great warranty, a year or 2,000 miles, whichever come first. And we're so proud that probably we are out of the few shop in the market that if you have a car that is under 75,000 miles and you service, we service your car. You're going to walk with the certificate that's good in the whole United States and Canada for 10,000 miles. So that, uh, you bring that up you can, anywhere in the country. So I've, I've driven back to California where I'm from originally. Uh, I, I bought a new truck and I've made that trip a few times. And before those trips, I got to make sure that I've got roadside assistance and all this stuff. But my biggest worry was I'm on the road and something happens to my truck. Like, and I have no idea. And I just bought a diesel engine. It was my first diesel. Now, you guys have a service now, we were talking about it on the break, it's called Golo. What is, what is Golo and what does that do? If you drive into California and you're stuck in the middle of Arizona in the, in the desert, you say, hey, I don't know what to do, my checking line is on, everybody panic. Mm -hmm. just, just, just give us a call to the office and we have a tech, they're gonna walk you through, they're gonna let you know if it is safe to you to keep driving, if it's not, we're gonna send a towing truck. So wow. that's amazing. That's incredible. I, I also, there's one other thing I wanted to ask you about. Uh, producer of our show, Ray Salinas, uh, he uses you guys and uh, you guys have a great, but I want you to tell me about the BMW that he brought into you guys. You know, it is funny. The reason that I'm here is because I was able to meet uh, Ray. Uh, he got his BMW in another shop for almost uh, 
three weeks. Oh, wow. He got a huge estimate. Uh, so a friend of mine talked to him. He brought the uh, car to our facility. Mm -hmm. We gave an estimate, and uh, he was kind of surprised. Are you sure that's going to be the price? And I said, yes, sir, we give you the best discount. He said, I'm not concerned about the price. I was concerned about the, uh, uh, how soon can you get it? So we call him in the next couple of hours to come and get your car. See, that's what's fantastic, M&M doing their job. Tell me about the pickup service available if needed. That's something else you guys provide. Yes, we do if you are probably, uh, we do offer that 30 miles around to a zip code. If you, you know, people, uh, it's kind of hard sometimes to get a taxi or ride. You just give us a call and we got somebody in your door. That's awesome. Yeah. You have that. Loaner cars available when they bring in their cars and, and trucks to get taken care of? Yeah, we got, uh, if I don't make a mistake, we probably around 30 cars for loaner, so anytime. And, and see, here's the other thing what's great. I mean, again, everybody wonders where to go. I always joke about, you got to have a guy? Well, we got the guy. It's Eddie Mendoza, <laughs> M&M. He gets it done right. We complete facility. We do everything. Speaking of your facility, tell us how big it is and where it's located. We are 1.5 acres, and uh, we got 20,000 square foot building, 30 bays, so we're working in 30 cars at the same time, and we're kind of wow. close to downtown Lowfield Airport, and you can always give us a call. Our phone number is 214-350-5984. Uh, give it one more time. 214-350-5984. Ladies and gentlemen, Eddie Mendoza, m and Auto Repair. We appreciate him as always, and of course, nice, we appreciate Tyler Klutz and Robert Turbin for being here. Thanks to everybody that came out tonight to the House of Blues for the live filming of Inside the Huddle. Special thanks to our executive producers, Ray Salinas, Chris Vandevener, and our audio engineers, Ted Nichols Payne, our production crew, Michael Thomas, Jordan Story, and Jamie Colbert. They've been doing a great job all year. Join us next week, a very special show. Two Hall of Famers, Heisman Trophy winners, Tony Dorsett and Tim Brown. Next week, tell a friend you don't want to miss it. Next week on Inside the Huddle. Inside the Huddle has been presented by Health Bite Center, A1 Affordable Garage Door Services, Accent Podiatry, Apple Vacations, Armor Wealth Management, Burt Maxwell Allstate Insurance, Sherry Garcia Innovations, Complete Customs and Complete Customs Coaches, Contractor Delivery Systems, D&G Credit, The Credit Cops, Dallas Bariatric Center, Dymaco, Diva Tequila, and Tequila Panasco, I Fly Indoor Skydiving, Jet Air, The Lisa Birdsong Group, Prime Lending, Will Austin Home Loans, and SOS Foundation Repair. Promotional consideration provided by Del Frisco's, Lombardo Custom Apparel, MM Auto Repair Inc., and Visa V Salon and Day Spa. Inside the Huddle is a sports media production. Executive producers Ray Salinas and Chris Vandeventer.